Okay, welcome back to Rock and Rattle Retreat. Fall of 2020. And looky here, March of 2022. Not that far ago, we got stumpage. Lots of stumpage. Look at all those stumps. It's incredible. Yeah, now there's no stumps. That was all stumps and big rocks. We're getting closer to the wire here of being ready for uh, footers. Still got this in to do. That's where the second garage and the north garage is going in. A few small trees to take out. And off to the races we go again. More clearing of rock and debris. Just seems like it's never ending. Yep, there rolls a rock. And it's getting a little rainy out. And we're placing a big boulder out here by the viewing area. And here is some real time work. This is why I like time lapse. This backhoe looks like it's going so slow compared to time lapse. But it takes some effort to push all this rock back. A little bit here, a little bit there. Pushing. Sometimes the rock doesn't fall where you want it. Kind of loosen up the rock there and pick it up and move it. And there is a lot of stuff to move. And we have a lot of big boulders to, to move or place or put somewhere out of the way. So when he comes across a nice looking one or something that's not too bad, ask me where to put it. Now we're back to this corner place where this boulder is fighting us to get out of here. 
he couldn't move it last time at all. Tried and tried with the backhoe. Now I'm in here with wedges and feathers, trying to create a, a straight line across so that it can be broken off. And then hopefully that top layer can be chunked off. Kind of hoping once this gets broken off that the rest of it will come out. So we go a little fast forward. <clears throat> you see the lines forming. That is a good crack going across there. And it's a lot of beating of those wedges. Just a lot of beating. But look at those cracks. Started with no cracks, drilled four holes. And, and granted, this has already had explosives put in it. In between the, the wedges there, in the middle, you can see a little red spot. Now, well, sort of red, dirty red. That's where one of the charges was placed, and it, and it blew up and did not break this rock. Because it blew out the cracks on the upper and lower, above and below this. So there's no sense setting any more charges in this because they'll just blow out the cracks in the sideways side of these. Okay, now this is after I got the wedges out. Look at all those nice cracks. That's a lot of work to get to this point. Now he does get this pride off. I don't get it on film. And then we drill some more holes and do some blasting. And you can see where this is cracking. The gases of the explosives come through those cracks. And there was no cracks and now there's a bunch of cracks in this. Now we also remeasured this rock, or the actual foundation area. And you can see that little orange dot up there. And the orange piece across is going down. That's where the foundation is going in. He comes in, lifts it up, and it's like it just magically comes apart. After that last blast. So that one's done. And then we get a rainstorm come through, nasty storm, about 20 minutes long, come through here and just dumped. You can see all the puddles. There is probably hundreds of gallons of water in this. It's in every crevice there. And then against the back wall. You can see back in there, there's a line of water and it stretches the entire back wall back there. But you can see where the, well, we could see where the low spots were and the high spots. So, you've got a better idea where it's got to be dug down just a little bit more. Here's the, the yard with the mill and look at those stacks of wood there. Getting there on those. Then the firewood. And here's some more rocks that we placed over here on the other side. Now this has been filled in. And then rocks placed on the edge where we stopped filling. Still got some out there on the left down there. Some more rock boulders. Keep anybody from going over the edge hopefully. Because it drops down like 25, 30 feet on that back side. And then we got one more rock over here. There it is. That was placed there this time. Okay. Look at that mountain. That's the top. Here's the build site. A lot of it pushed back. Still got some to go. Still got some more on this end to do. A few little trees to take out. And we're looking for this to come out better. We're going to get a better view out of it here eventually. Once the build site's done, we can take down some more trees on this side of the mountain to get a better view. 
to look at more of this. Thanks for watching. Keep track of us by subscribing. And I'll catch you on the next one.